This little video shows a problem that I had with my uh, with in Android Studio. Normally, I'm working with uh, Visual Studio, so this is especially on Android Studio. And my problem is <coughs> that the return uh, did not work, and I showed you the solution. So that little script what you see there is uh <coughs> whenever I click on there, um, it should compare the value of this one with something else and as soon as it matches uh, it should return the value and break uh, this method so when I select it uh, nothing happens <coughs> as soon as I go there onto my breakpoint I will see that uh, the machine stops there the debugger and the machine says okay here uh, <coughs> we have uh, the search value this is uh, I said okay <coughs> search for that string which I selected and what is in my um, comparison work here's a search something for uh, an, a search an item in an array and it said okay here's the match the match is true so I said okay give me the s row string row is uh, the value which uh, against it should uh, versus it should compare and uh, the search value is the value which comes from the drop-down spinner so <coughs> and the match is uh, whenever the uh, row value is equals to the search value strings are compared in uh, in Android uh, by equals so when this matches and the match is true that it's what that's what it says here then when I step further and I have a breakpoint here on return then it I expected that it should go there but shoop, it jumps out and something else happened so uh, I was not sure what happened there and I had that problem the point is that um, in the debugger as you see there there's a cross there's not no exu, uh, exec, executable code found at line 16 so it jumps out and uh, it gives me back the in the debugger mode the ba uh, the wrong value as soon as I change that and said okay I create a, a match point there and when I <coughs> do it again uh, when if I compile it again and run it then the code goes in there as soon as it starts and there's a spinner and then it breaks there and after this the code um, goes out of that uh, point here it is it steps over step over and then it uh, runs out of that routine straight by that return uh, return a value and it return in this case I was interested uh, how would it uh, work in return does it even break the method so as we see here uh, as it's this was not expected from uh, most uh, forums which I have re read uh, it should jump out of the method but it did, did not so it's uh, jumped out of the subroutine this uh, for each or uh, for something else and it jumped out of there and now it's uh, this is the wrong return value because this one was one and this is zero and when I step over uh, then it would be back now uh, when I take this one let's say <coughs> when I say uh, whenever it is give me the return value what does it say makes unreachable statement because it's behind that I would say here uh, exit that's my exit <coughs> and the, in this case it always returns zero and it doesn't break in here or so it matches okay so we say here 
a match. This is my match. Let's exit. Uh, that's the uh, auto uh, loop. And we say here it's a length, length, uh, come on, short. And this is the length long. When I run it, <coughs> we will see it now here in our app debugger. Then it connects, and now it says there's a match. And when it's selected, it comes, it says there's a match, but uh, it, it jumps out of there, it doesn't reach this one in my uh, debugger, it goes on there. So when I'm here with my debugger, <coughs> then I'm and I rerun it here. So it will go in there and I step now through and now it jumps uh, to the outer point and it returns a zero. But uh, I think this one is not really reached. If I would say, okay, give me back my the value which we have got. So take this one. The <coughs> I said that point was given in here. Index toast me this one. Uh, da -da 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 -da. This one and toast me the return value. Return value was ID URL, that's this one. And in this case, can't resolve method because um, <coughs> get context. based on context I'm not sure let's see or oh, get parent uh, we will see <coughs> I think it's now right here it matched and returns a zero so this was always the same it re returns me a zero or so it should return me a one or two match and oh, return one so it doesn't come to that point so I think the debugger in this point would be uh, not working the correct way 